when we talk about the thin overlays that we've been playing with for the last 10 years, around about 10 years, maybe by now, there's actually three thin overlays. This one is called a, a fine PFC. The largest aggregate in this thing here is three, three quarter, three eighth of an inch across. And you know what PFCs are, they're the ones that cut down the noise and improve the drainage, uh, improve the splash spray. Uh, this one here is uh, placed typically around about three quarters of an inch thick. And it really does a wonderful job of, of taking the water away and reducing noise. It saves money because of the, the thickness and, and there's all the benefits of the PFCs. It's got 20% air voids, water hits this thing, goes down and flows out. You need an impermeable layer beneath the thing. This is what's called the Tom C mix. Placed anywhere from three quarters to one inch, normally around about one inch thick. It costs you about 30% more per ton. But as it's put down as a one inch mat instead of a two inch mat, that ends up with a, a saving of about 30% per square yard when you place this stuff down. Performance has been excellent. Uh, it uses top quality asphalt. It uses very high quality rocks. The last mix is what's called a Tom F. It's Tom Fine. This is the one that we think has got great potential here. It can be put down and it has been put down at a half inch thickness. When they're rehabilitating some of the interstate roads, as, as you go, you know, the trucks are usually traveling in one lane, which is the slow lane. Um, so they get beaten up. Well, the fast lane is usually in good shape. So normally they come and mill two inches off both and then put two inches overlay. Well, in order to save money, the Atlanta district says, well, we're going to take two inches off the slow lane but in the fast lane, we're just gonna put a half inch mat down. They didn't mill off two inches, they milled off an inch and a half in the, in the travel lane and then put a two inch overlay in the travel lane. In the, in the fast lane, they just put a half inch. There really is many, many advantages for going for the thin. If you continue to put thicker, you know, the two inch overlays on there, we have all of these external things that you have to worry about, like the guardrails. You cannot start raising the road because you have safety issues there. So if you put two inches after two inches after two inches with guardrails and bridge clearances. So really there's a lot of a lot more other benefits from, from keeping thin. Um, it's a lot less less work to get set up to do this. And if if you can, you know, if you get the same kind of life that we got out of the thicker overlays uh, from these higher quality rocks and higher quality asphalt, it's not just a win on that cost, it's a win on these other things that you have to be concerned about. You know, the safety aspects and the clearance aspects and stuff like that. So.